Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to see how we can retrieve the KB Little on the remote computer. So we have a three script here and we have a three clients, server one, server two and three. So this three computer name is listed in this text file. And we have used the servers as a variable here and we have used the for each command to run the command on each computer. Invoke command hyphen computer name and the each server name will appear here and then script block we have given the command get hyphen hotfix so what it will do it will retrieve all the kps that is installed on the remote computer that we have specified in this text file we haven't used any other filter because that filter you will see here in this two script here we have used the format table or to style so whatever the result it will give it will give in the table format here we are exporting the file using the out hyphen file command and we have used the encoding here utf8 for the this text file we have used here append command so it will insert the data in the same file for each computer error action we have given as a silently continue so if you face any issue during the script run it will continue the script here in the second script we have used the date filter now what it will do it will retrieve the data from two date here the first we have used the gt it means greater than and here we have used less than so it will collect the data between these two date and it will show us in the output format now here in the third script we have used the days filter so we have used minus 90 or you can specify any date like minus 5 as well minus 1 2 3 anything that you want what it will do it will collect the today's date and it will minus that date like the 5 so from two days to back in five days it will retrieve the data if you specify here 90 then it will from the two days date it will look the data for past 90 days and it will give you the result I am running the script here. You can see here it have collected data for three computer. Now this data is without filter. So you have got everything that is installed on the remote computer. So we can see server one, server two and server three. So all the data has been re recovered. So let me delete this file and we'll run the another script so let me show you here you can see the uh, kb install date is not same so some have installed in the this month some installed in the last month so according to that we'll put a filter and we'll get the data so we'll check the second script now where we have used the date filter and we'll use the second month so let me retrieve the data for the ninth month that is the current month September if I run this script it will give me the data only for the September 2022 and only two computers have the latest KB installed on server 1 and server 2 you can see here 99 and here as well 99 but on the third computer it is not there okay the output is ready let me open that and you can see server one and server two only these two computer are there because it have the latest things so according to this we can let me delete this again we can uh, change the filter and here we can give the greater than date some old like six months and we can run the script now this time it will have the more data as compared to the last output because from 6 to 9 there are so many kbs installed on these three computer so it will it will retrieve all the kbs and you can see here okay so we got all the data so you can use this script uh, by using the date filter so you just have to give the start date and the end date and it will uh, collect all the kbs installed between that two dates 
now here we have a third script where we have the days filter so i can give the five days like i just want a data uh, from the remote computer from past five days so if i run this script okay it will only give me the data from last five days okay okay so only two kb in the same scenario if i increase the days count like i want last 30 days uh, data to be retrieved okay And you can see only two KPs. Let me put it 90 days here and run the script. Okay, and you can see here now the more data has been recovered because within 90 days there are so many KB installed but within 30 days only these two KB is installed so you can use the script for your requirement and if you face any issue you can just put it to the comment box and I'll try to answer that thank you for watching the video